Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Asuncrit Valhalla video. After the update 1.6.1, we can finally finish the Tombs of the Fallen with the part 2. After this video, you will know where all of the tombs are located and also where to find the artifacts that you need in order to open the final tomb. Tombs of the Fallen don't have any quest marks or anything like that, so you basically have to know where to go, where to look. And you can start all of this after building up the Raven's Torp. The first tomb, it will be Manius Sanctum right across of Raven's Torp. In the end of the Manius Sanctum, you will have this huge stone map that is pretty much showing you like general location, where to go, where to look for the runes. And when you are looking for the runes using Raven, you will see a Vortex. So that is actually pretty helpful. You can spot them pretty good distance away. But before moving on, like I said, you need the artifacts in order to open the last tomb, and the last tomb it is also located in the Manius Sanctum. So that is the password for the last tomb. Just to make this simple, this is the first location and also the last location. What you do between doesn't matter, you can go into the tombs in any order that you like. But remember, all of the artifacts in order to open the last tomb will be located after the cutscenes in your exit route, somewhere in there after the cutscene. And I will be guiding you to the tombs, to the artifacts, but before I do, please hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications, so you won't ever miss anything. That being said, thank you, and let's move on, quote unquote. First location, Cassibelanus tomb, that is located in Skiropeshire, pretty much northwest from the Ravenstorp, here on the map. And the tomb, it is pretty much right across from this fast travel point, and here we are gonna see the Vortex, there you go. Coming to the Odin rune, inspect it, and the tombs are revealed, this applies to every single one including the last one, so let's go, Cassivellanus tomb, here we go. After solving the puzzle, seeing the cutscene, looting the chest, just go straight, to the exit, there are a couple lifts, take them and just follow my lead if you need to. Soon we are at the part door and don't worry, you haven't missed anything, not just yet. Break the seal, after the door, there's a broken bridge, go across that one. And now be careful, when passing the main area, do not go on the zip line, but jump down, so no chippy chippy zip line, just go down into the water under the waterfall and here you will have the artifact collect it you will hear some nonsense after you have done that let's move on to the next one the next tomb it is pretty close to this one in Yervikshire just under the fast travel point once again so I will meet you there and all of the locations will be timestamped tomb by tomb Hi again. So here we are in Yervikshire, just under the viewpoint in Venutius tomb. This is pretty much same as the previous one. Solve the puzzles. After the cutscene, looting the gear chest, let's find the artifact for you, shall we?
Now, when everything has been completed, let's find the artifact. So, right from the chest, just go forward until you are seeing the lift. Take the lift from top of this path, you will see a mammoth skull. And the mammoth skull is actually looking towards the place that you need to go. There is breakable ice wall, very small one, break it. And after that, in the room that is hidden, there you will find the artifact and one piece for the password. We are now one step closer of solving everything. So let's head into the East Anglia in Pudica's tomb. That is actually the last tomb from the first ones. So here we go. This might be a little bit more trickier than two other ones. But use the raven and see the vortex. And boom, easy, easy, easy as that. So Pudica's tomb, same as for the others, completed. Solve the puzzle, see the cutscene, loot the chest, after that let's find the artifact. Pudica's tomb completed, or is it? Before going into the exit, Find a couple of small crates on the ground in the same room that we are in at the moment. There we go, break them and go underneath. You will find the last artifact from the first tombs. So there we go, more nonsense artifact. Now to the new runes, Verica's tomb in Hamptonshire. So here on the map, just like the others, if you need, scout the area with your raven, inspect the Odin rune, complete the puzzle and just be aware, this tomb was actually, in my opinion, one of the hardest ones. Just like for the other ones, see you after everything. Now the chest is looted, we are getting the Veruca sickle from here. Let's take a quick look of that weapon, let's put it on, after that let's find the artifact. And in my opinion, the artifacts were much easier to find in the new ones than in the first ones. But the tombs, they were longer or harder, so nice balance in my opinion. We are closing on the artifact and what makes this much easier, keep your volume up because you will hear some issue language but after the lift, look any path to the left, after going under the wall, over the broken bridge, you will see the artifact right over here, collect it and there we go, do. Now to the last artifact, or 
last rune in Sussex. This was actually one of the first Odin runes ever found, thanks to Dark Strider and his community. We already did know where to go, where to look, so let's solve everything in Tokodominus tomb. In my opinion, out of the three, this was the easiest one to solve. So after loading the chest, take the exit path, and you cannot miss it. Jump into the water, go left, and right over there you are seeing it, hearing it, so let's collect it. As Eivor said, now we need to go in Manius Sanctum, right across of Ravensthorp. So that was pretty much dead giveaway. When Eivor is speaking those lines, you need to go back. And like I said, it doesn't matter in which order you are doing the dooms between the first and last one. What is counted, you need to collect all of the artifacts. And here on the map, I'm showing you every single tomb location that is out there. But let's head out. To the first tomb, Manius Sanctum, and let's hear the password, and let's see what is gonna happen after the password. That was awesome. But for now, before rolling the outro, I really want to thank my channel members and top donators of the channel. You guys are awesome. And if you want to become part of the Elite Wolf Pack, aka the channel members, there's a join button below this video with different levels, different perks, like custom emojis, early access to some of my videos, just like this one, and much more. So keep your eyes on the channel. And for now, let's roll the outro. Thanks for watching, remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong, hope to see you in the next one, Skatha, over and up, and bye bye.